Yo, what's up, monkeys? So today, I'm going to be reviewing three Gorilla Tag fan games with mods. So, let's get into the first one. So, the first one that we have is Project Moose. Oh, and guys, before I start reviewing, make sure that you like and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Because if my content's not big, I'm not going to make anything. Anyways, this is Project Moose. It has this, a PC, computer interface, and it has extra numbers so that you could get a, um, you see, you could get a custom color code. It has bark mod menu that all work. Look, you see, you got rockets and stuff. The platforms work. Fly works. And you aim with your hand. Um, bubble works. It just gives you low gravity, though. Um, nail gun. I don't think that one works. Which means and no tag fees. They all work. And now, you have VIP user. So basically, VIP is like, look, in the city, you see that thing up there? It gives you golden cosmetics when you, when you unlock it with the time. So now over here, we have custom cosmetics, a OG badge. Oh, that's really it for that. We have this from the old update. And we have a J-Man Curly, and we have a Creeper Head. So now, it, we have a modded wardrobe with a bunch of these mods. And it has a camera mod that I'm actually going to be using for the rest of the video. And it, and it actually works. As you guys can see, I'm using it right now. So, I'm actually going to use Wisers. Because I really like this one. Yeah, this one is a good one. So, as you guys can see, right there, it has multiple of these. And now for the mod menus, it has Moose Public Menu. The, um, what's it called? I forgot what that one was called. And it has Shiba, and it has Shiba Dark Menu. So now... We also have more menus, such as I Rock Menu, I Stupid Menu, and the Comp Client. So, add-ons. For this, we just have FPS. That just shows the FPS thing up there. And now for more materials, we have... Look. I'm actually going to put it here. We have this one, you could look clear. This one, which makes you look like city map. And this one, which makes you look gold. So now, on the next page, we have this one, which makes you RGB. This one, which makes you galaxy. And this one, which makes you your regular color code. But it's neon because of the um the special color codes that I showed you earlier. Yeah, so besides that, servers are kind of dookie. Oh, and also, we have even more materials here. We have this one, which makes me look like a donut. My regular color code, which again, I have neon because I have the special color code from the computer. And this one, that makes me look transparent. Now, the next one, we have beans, kind of like Dale Bill. Pizza, which is one of my personal favorites. And we have cow, which I really like this one too, but I like the pizza better.
I'm actually gonna keep the pizza one on for the rest of the video. So let's just get into the mod menus now. So uh dang it, I can't really control stuff with this. Alright. There we go, mod menus now. So as you can see it has the ones I already showed you. More materials, I already showed you those. Um alright. So now for songs it has um that song and they all work <laughs> yep all the songs work and now this is one of my personal favorite mods too um this one it, they don't really work but in future updates they will work so it has different um different like thingies for forests so like it has um autumn leaves summer leaves and winter and also here it has rain and then the stick is like just no leaves so yeah and custom maps it has a diner which is really cool i'm actually gonna show you guys it So, as you guys can see, I'm at the diner right now. <coughs> um, how do I get in? Oh, I could get in. And you see, you could get, you could get, like, drinks and stuff. As you can see right there, you could get drinks. Um, you could get donuts you could get um you could get like limes and stuff um sauce and stuff as you can see we got ketchup and mustard right there so now over here it's the same thing now over here they have really cool stuff which i like they have um sprite pepsi um, Coke and Fanta, well, Orange Fanta, you know, so now, <laughs> well, yeah, it's basically the same thing all over, and as you can see, it has, like, the tables and stuff, you know, all around and stuff, and it has the trash can, wait, is there anything in here, oh, we could go in here, all right, so this basically is a whole cook room, kind of looks like the Spongebob cooking room, it's really cool as you can see over here it has like the the grill and stuff you know it has the the frying stuff it's really cool but anyways I think it's time to get out of here Oh, it's over here. And also, as you can see, it has a monkey map loader thing over here. As you can see, right there has a monkey map loader thing, which is pretty cool to me. It spawns me in forest, though, for some reason. But that's not what this video is for, because there's a lot more cooler stuff in the city. So, yeah. Let's go. So. <laughs> and I'm also going to change my camera mod too. <laughs> to a different one. Uh, oh, no. What the? Yeah, I'm going to change it to this one. I like it better. Yeah, this one is better than the other one. Alright, so anyways. Let's go over here. Oh, and it has buttons, too. It can... It has follow player, which I really like. It's pretty cool. It just follows me. And stuff, you know. It doesn't really work, though. Uh, 
yeah, yeah, that's a cool one. Third person. Oh, I like this one. So, like, it kind of has, like, the camera in third person. Alright, anyways, we're going here. We're, we're going to see some special cosmetics and stuff. As you can see, we have a holdable Doug the Bug, which I meant to buy. Um, a J-Man curly head. Um... Yeah, it has that. Uh, the thing from the music update. And the creeper head. And then it has the fork and knife. It has the shotgun. And it has Doug the Bug. Now, over here, you can see that it has a booster menu. That you can get when you boost their Discord server. It costs two boosts. And you get Shiva Gold Menu. Which is pretty cool. So now, over here, as you can see, you got like a bajillion shiny rocks. As you can see. So now the rest of it is pretty much normal Gorilla Tag. For some reason, they removed the badges over here, and they replaced the bow tie with um the OG badge, which, as you can see, I have on right now. Well, I don't know if you can see it, but it's on right now. Oh, no, it's not on. Hold on. I have to put it on real quick. Oh, yeah, as you can see, I have it on right now. But, yeah basically the whole game it's pretty cool <laughs> anyways on to the next one I guess oh oh no never mind never mind on to the next one so the next one is called um project blade oh wait no 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 blaze not blade and this one is one of the more, like, ordinary copies. Not in a bad way. It's still pretty good. But, like, you know, it has, um, these that don't work. FOV doesn't work. Flip doesn't work. It just, it's just here. And, you know, it doesn't even, you know, work. Um... It has computer interface, which is basically the regular computer with just a redesign. Uh, it has these mod pages, which when you click on it, you go over here. So it has name tags. Okay, I guess that doesn't work. Punch mod, steam long arms, which I don't like because they're not really steam long arms. Next one we have... OP speed boost, which is just a regular speed boost. Snidewind, that good. Super monkey. It's a good super monkey. And you can actually aim it with your head instead of having to turn your um your hand everywhere. And regular long arms. Which, when you turn them off... And you really kind of can't turn them off. So I guess my head is just going to be glitched like this for the rest of the video. Until I go to the next game. Anyways. Page 3. We have most of speed. It just gives you a little speed boost. Which I like this one better than the regular speed boost. If you're willing to, like, you know, like, play, like, scrims in this game or anything. Uh, you know, Tag Freeze, you know what that does. Platforms, for some reason, they're broken. And now here, page four. No clip. Um, A on the controller. Ghost Monkey. Doesn't work. 
bedroom mod. It does work. I like this one. But that's really it. And now, I think I'm going to turn on Super, Super Monkey again to showcase the Omi up. Because for some reason, there's like this thing at Only Up where like <clears throat> you can't really make the jump. So I'm going to have to use this for it. Now you press this to turn the Only Up off. Now, this is it. If you see that tree over there, that's the jump that I was talking about. That it kind of doesn't let you make. So I'm just going to have to fly over here and then continue. They really expected us to make that jump. But I made it. Now this only up it's pretty easy if you have the right mods enabled. Okay, for some reason that froze me in there. It doesn't look so bad. Actually, I don't think it's gonna be too long. I think I'll still have time. For the rest of the video and stuff. Oh no, it's so long. Right up here. Squid. <laughs> That's gonna be easy. This one have colliders. This one does oh they all have colliders <laughs> oh we completed it <clears throat> yeah wasn't too bad why does my head look like that No, yeah, whatever. That's all the game has to offer anyway. So I we need to go back. I was going to the last game though. So, last game is Chilia Runners. Or Chiwana Runners. I don't know how to pronounce it. Because it has a 1 in it instead of an L. So, this game has like a bunch of stuff. But, for some reason, it doesn't have a mod menu. But it has like a billion other mods. So it has this. A custom thingy it has a bunch of cosmetics and stuff scattered all around the maps it has a custom caves which i really like because it will only decorate forests in some regular games as you can see it has a bunch of these and they all work and stuff it has a giant map right here Anyways, time to go back. So, all their mods do work. Uh, it has this one, that one, and this one doesn't work. That's only up. It's pretty fun too. It's pretty fun. And it has RTX, which I really like. Platforms, they work, but they don't rotate. Long arms, they work, but it breaks my head again. Oh, crap. No, 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 no. Oh, this one does work.
Okay. It just takes really long to turn on. Anyways, we have Super Monkey. And turn it off. As you can see, I just showcased it. Along with no clip, because I didn't want to fall through the map. Um, speed boost is just a regular speed boost in order to make it go that fast. Um, this stuff, I don't know about it. This is just a jacket thing, but you can't really put it on. Uh, the bedroom stuff, it does work and it all has collision, which is pretty cool. Now let's check this one out, because I haven't seen this one. What? Okay. These all have collision. Alright, I'm out of here. <clears throat> Wait, what is this? Oh no, it just made me fall down. Alright, anyways. This was the last one. Um. So basically. For the first two. You're gonna need either HIO or um, side quest. But this one that I'm in right now, you can get it on App Lab. But servers are down right now. And these, th this one and two, you have to get it on. Um, you have to get it on HIO along with Gorilla Tag Core 2. You need to get that one from there. Then after that, just install it from CX File Explorer. If you don't know how to get that, just watch the tutorial on YouTube. But yeah, I know it's bad.